Welcome to Master Guitar Fred. My name is Jörg. Today I'm going to teach you how to determine what key harmonica you need for the key of a particular song. Okay, so let's go check it out. You try to figure out what key harmonica you need for a blues in G. Then just go play the major scale, G, A, B, C. So it's the fourth note in G, it's, it's C. You need the C harp. In A, it's D. In B, it's E. In C, it's F. In D, it's G. And in E, it's A. That is for cross harp. So now you know that when your band or when the song is in the key of A, and it's a blues or a rock progression, most likely you're going to need the key of D in the harp, okay? It's the fourth note in the major scale. So A, B, C, D. Hope this helps. Of course, if you play folky songs, then you can use a G harp for a song in G. Let's look at the minor songs. When we play a song in a minor key, just like Heart of Gold in E minor, what kind of harp are we going to use and how are we going to determine it? determine the key of harmonica you need to play in a particular song that is played in minor key, I'll show you a, a quick cool trick. So I just played Heart of Gold in E minor and the harp that I used was the G harp. Okay, so open E, skip one step and half step. That will be the key of the harp you need for the E chord. Okay? If the tune is in F minor, you go again, play the whole step from F to G and a half step. That will be the key of harp that you're going to need for this F minor. And of course, in between the F, uh, the G and the A, we have a G sharp or an A flat. So you need an A flat harp. In A, we go. And this here is C. So you need a C harp for B minor. Again, skip one full and a half step, and that will give you the note you need. And that's a D. So B minor, you need a D harp. A C minor, it's the 11th fret, the pinky, right? And the 11th fret. So full step, half step, 11th fret. We're in between a D and an E. So that's an E flat or a D sharp harp you're going to need for a for a C minor, for a 
G minor, you're going to need full step, half step, will put you on the F. So you, for a D minor, you're going to need an F harp. If you can memorize that, then you always know which harp to reach for. I hope from now on you always reach for the nice harp when your band plays in a particular key or when a song plays that you want to accompany with a harp. Okay, Whether it's a cross harp, uh, a blues rock tune, whether it's a straight country or a folky song where the key of the harp is the same as the key of the song or whether it's a song in a minor chord where you do need to reach for something a little different. I hope this lesson will help you just do that. Okay, thanks for stopping in. Thanks for watching. See you next time.